The Bayelsa state government has entered into an agreement with some foreign firms to use drone technology to supply vaccines and other emergency medical aids to hard-to-reach areas in the state. The partnership, which is tagged the Bayelsa Health Supply Chain Transformation Project, is part of efforts to boost healthcare service delivery in the state. Our correspondent Jesse Essay has the details. Signing the Memorandum of Understanding. The project is a $5 million investment by a consortium of firms and the Bayeso State Government to improve access to health care within and outside Yenagua, the state capital. Bayeso is over 70% water. However, this project will reduce the risks associated with water transportation and bad weather, amongst others. If we key into this project and this program, it will alleviate the suffering of our people, particularly in the interland, and those who can hardly have access to health facilities. And I had no doubt in my mind that it was a project that was worth doing and I gave my approval. Time from getting to assess the vaccine and then giving it to the recipient is a very long hour. So what this aims to achieve is to reduce that time. For example, you spend three to four hours trying to get to where your vaccine location, your world headquarters is, and then you move back another two hours to the health facility before you now administer the vaccine to the, to the recipient, the person who wants to receive the vaccine. Now, the drone is going to travel just about 30 minutes. This is coming at no cost on the state government. Consortium partners have invested their own money into it to ensure that we can really do this here. So, uh, in terms of uh, infrastructure or capital cost investment, it is not costing uh, the government or the people of Bielsa State any money. So the system can supply anything that can fit into the box. So, uh, we are really focused on healthcare. So, we'll be supplying um, blood vaccines, medical products, so anything for malaria, whatever disease you can think of, we'll be able to supply them. This health supply chain transformation will further improve and enhance uh, most of the activities that we intend to you know, execute the health summit blueprint. The initiative is also expected to provide job opportunities for residents as 100% of the manpower needed will be sourced from the state. Jesse A.C. Plus TV News, Yenagua. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.